Janet Ayala uh, with the Car Loft. Um, I am coming to you just to show you a, f a few more um, paper pumpkin alternatives that I made. These are just uh, going to show you how I made them. I basically am not going to make them with you here, but I'm just going to show you how to make them. I already have another video where I show you a one that I did live. I found out that it is on. Um, it's on the internet so you can still look at it and see how I made those But these are my additional ones that I am coming up with. I also ordered the summer nights add-ons To my set so I will be showing a couple of cards made this and then I am NOT I haven't made any of these yet These are the ones that uh, you're supposed to make with the set But I haven't made any of them yet. So I've just made up my own my own thing uh, so today I have three more cards that I want to show you that I have made using these uh, this paper pumpkin um, paper and cards and uh, embellishments and all the goodies that came with it. Uh, if you don't know what a paper pumpkin is, it's a monthly subscription that you can uh, subscribe to. It comes to your home every month, once a month. It's $22 and you get a whole bunch of goodies. You don't really know exactly what you're going to get. Uh, lately, we've been t they've been telling us like what we're going to get, but they don't tell us like what it looks like or what's inside or anything. Like for the next, next month, we already know it's going to be about, um, and I think I showed this already to you guys, it's gonna be about our celebrating our life's champions like nurses and doctors and um, EMT, um, anybody that's out there putting their neck out in the front lines, basically. And so, that is going to be what the paper pumpkin is going to be for next month. So, if you have uh, families and people that uh, you'd like to send cards to, this little set will bring usually nine, eight, nine cards. Um, and you can make them yourself. It brings everything that you will need. It brings your stamp set. It brings any embellishments that you may need. It brings the paper. It brings the envelopes. All of these things will come in the set. It even, if you're ordering your first um, paper pumpkin, it even brings your block that you're going to need to take your stamp sets off and put on here and, and put them on your, on your paper. It also brings us an uh, ink spot. And for this uh, month's, and they'll give you the ink that you're going to need as well. So everything is included in these packets that come to your home. It's really, really fun. I just look forward every month to opening my, my paper pumpkin and seeing what um, I'm going to be getting every month. So if you're really interested in, in getting one, uh, I'm going to leave the link down under. So you can go ahead and click it and then go ahead and sign up for it. You can sign up for... Uh, one month at a time or you can sign up for three months six months and a year i believe so look at the options there and see what you want and see if you are interested in doing something like this um if you're not really um a creative very very creative like you don't really know how to put things together this is really ideal because uh, this gives you everything that you need and it tells you step by step how to make it inside here it gives you instructions Stampin' Up! also puts out instructions online on YouTube, and so you can watch it there as well. So it's, it's exciting. I, I really, really enjoy um, getting this every month. It's so much fun. I really, uh, sometimes I'll make the cards that they sh they're showing, but this month I haven't made any of these cards that they're showing. I'm just really making my own thing. So um, let me show you what I made. Let's put everything aside here. And I... Uh, I'm just gonna show you the ones I already um, did. I think I showed you these already on my last video. So this is one I made, and I show you how I made them and everything on those videos. And on the live video, I actually show you um, how I make how I, how I made these. But I'm not gonna have one for um, this is the one I made also. This is the one that I made online with you guys, and then these are the rest. Okay. So those are the options that I made. I don't know if I told you, but this was... Yeah, I think I told you what this was. Okay. That's on the video as well. Okay? All right. And so the ones I'm making for this um, video are these. This is the, the same um, paper that comes... This paper comes with the paper pumpkin. The card on top. 
then this one came with the add-ons so I kind of basically did an add-on on top of a paper pumpkin um, card um, cardstock and so I put that on there these little things came in the kit so I put that down at the bottom and then these little stars also come with the kit you get a whole bunch of them okay so those came with the kit I added some three stars here but then I wanted to put like make it like burst these fireworks like kind of burst and so I I found the little star from the stamp set of the manger this manger uh, stamp set that we have in the holiday catalog or the August to December catalog and I'm using this little burst I, I die cut it in gold and that's what I put here and here and here and here okay and then I kind of just sprayed it, uh, not sprayed it, but kind of like I brushed it with some Wink Stella. I put Wink Stella all around the, the burst so it kind of glitters. So I don't know if you see the glitter or not, but um, it's on there so that it can kind of glitter and look like it's uh, really bursty. Okay, so that's the first one. And then this is the envelope. These envelopes come with the, with the add-ons, okay? The ones, the add-ons come with the this little inside is, is decorated and then it has this gold trim. So these come with the add-ons. Since it had that gold trim, I thought it would go perfect with this as well. Okay, so that's one. Then I did this one. I just can't get enough of this vase. I Every time I see a vase, I just want to put flowers all over it. So that's what I did. <laughs> I used uh, the blooms. Uh, this one here basket of blooms I cut all these flowers those little uh, twigs and the little flower here and that's going down and then I, I, I colored some of them with my uh, just jade marker all of these are being colored I left some without being colored then I did this little tiny flower and I used Rococo Rose I also used the ribbon this ribbon that um, is in the catalog as well I don't remember the name of this but that I used here and then for this I used the sentiment from here from the ferns okay so that's it I just basically put the um, vase there and just started decorating it all around I actually pressed a couple of them right on the paper um, a couple of these I like this one I stamped it right there behind I don't know if you can see those and then this one I stamped it right here behind as well just to give it a little bit full more fullness and then these I cut out and I put there um, on the side okay so those are basically um, the flowers and let me put it up so you can see it a little bit closer all right so that's for the second one and then the third one is the well done I've been working on well done all week and I wanted to make a well done card um, because I'm working on this card um, on the stamp set this week. So, isn't this? I just love this little turtle. She's just looking at you. <laughs> She's so cute. And this comes from the paper, guys. This paper is so beautiful. It has, like, I just cut them out right from here. See this one? She's looking at you. Um, you know, you can just cut them out from here and then just put them on your paper. This is actually a paper pumpkin paper. I just, when I look at it, I just, it just, I just saw the water um, kind of coming to the edge or something. So what I did is I basically used the stamp set, the well done, and I put these on with um, shaded spruce, shaded spruce all around. I put the tall ones at the end, then I put the smaller ones here in the middle. Okay, put a small ones behind the turtle, like swimming around. And then I put the two turtles here. This one is flat and this one's on dimensionals. And then I stamped the little seahorses, two of them, put them together. And I mat it with the, um, I'm trying to use the same colors that is on the paper, basically. So I mat it with um, Gorgeous Grape. And the card is actually um, the shade, it's not, the Just Jade. Okay, and I just put a couple of the little fish uh, seahorses there and I use the sentiment from here my love for you is bigger than the ocean and then I used 
This one is actually from the paper pumpkin. This uh, the paper pumpkin envelopes do not come lined like the other one, the add-ons did. So I was able to use that and um, put it together with this. So I made three cards this time. I hope you like them, and I hope you are able to create them. If you if you are, please tag me on the car loft uh, on Instagram. Tag me with the car loft on Facebook. Tag me with the um, uh, with my name, Janet Ayala, as well, if you like. Okay, so I can see what you created, or if it looks like sort of like mine, or if you made something different. So I would love to see it. Um, but yes, if you are really interested in Paper Pumpkin, do please go on my page. Uh, down below you'll see the, um, the link and you can go and sign up for it and start getting your own. Uh, you need to sign up before August 10th so that you will be able to receive August Paper Pumpkin. Okay, And so every month I come here and I show you different alternatives that you can do using, um, ex using um, either your leftovers sometimes we have a lot of leftovers or using your um using your just your regular set because this is my regular set i haven't not done any of my of the ones that they are suggesting in the thing yet so um yeah all right well thanks for coming by this is going to be a short one um hope you have a, having a blessed day and take care bye